what is up everybody and welcome to a brand new video it's time to leave miami so i am out in jupiter florida picking up a super light load about 600 pounds and it's only going to take up 20 feet on the trailer let's go see what it is all right picking up these four little bundles for t-mobile going to iowa but here's what we got not too bad all right guys so they just gave me my bol and it says 1047 pounds it's four little bundles so not too bad easy peasy got half a trailer empty try to find another load and we'll be good All right, guys these are these are super light i don't think this is anywhere near a thousand pounds because i can move these things by hand easily so here's what we got took up half the trailer let's get it all strapped down All right, guys, I used three straps. That's more than enough for this load because this is super light. Here's what we got. We got one four inch strap. We got a smaller belly strap here. And we got another four inch strap. That's what we got. Easy peasy. <laughs> Ready to hit the road. This is going to Iowa. Uh, probably drive up to Georgia and try to find a load out of there tomorrow morning and we got half a trailer empty so and this is super light got to use up the whole trailer or at least try to so let's hit the road and see if we can get something else tomorrow morning all right guys currently heading over to Albany Georgia to pick up an addition to my load should be picking up one forklift going to Minneapolis area, Minnesota. We'll stay. 
still have a little bit of room left on the trailer so maybe get lucky and get something small as well but not really planning on it but this little addition is going to help out for sure so let's head on over see what we got get loaded and get on the way forklift doesn't want to go up the ramps it just keeps on slipping All right, here's what we got. Let's get this thing chained down and hit the road. the back is easy but the front they don't really they don't really make any chain down spots so the only thing that I see the only thing I see is I can attach my hooks right over here that's about as good as it's gonna get
Got everything chained down. Use two chains and three binders. You got one chain on the rear of the forklift with one binder. And we have one chain on the front with two binders. And this is slightly over 8,000 pounds, they said. All right, guys, two partials so far. One's going to Iowa, around Des Moines area, and this one's going around Minneapolis, Minnesota area. I guys just dropped off my first load over in Iowa heading over to Minneapolis Minnesota area uh, I'm gonna find a truck stop on the way because this load the second load is not being dropped until tomorrow morning so I found the loves which is about uh, so we're about a little less than four hours away from uh, second destination got a loves uh, about a little more than halfway there I think I'm gonna stop there and then drive the rest in the morning so let's head on over need to fill up and we'll call it a night pulled up to the receiver for to drop my second load I'm about to go unchain it and get it off the trailer
that guy's dropped off that load and now the waiting game begins again there are quite a few loads out of the minneapolis area um just lost one there was a four thousand dollar load going to arizona but somebody snatched it up super quick while my dispatcher was on the phone but there are quite a few loads so um i think we'll be able to get out of here today so we'll probably just have to wait a little bit it's still 9 30 a.m i'll make my breakfast and um go from there see you guys shortly